know. No, it's not. Yeah, but people have really been going on saying it is. It's I know, not. It's, not. it's disgusting. Look, they, they look a wreck. Same yeah. way as blokes without their tops mm. on in the summer. It's uh, not acceptable to go oh, and I don't, shop. I don't, I don't do that. <laughs> no, but a lot of men Are you trying to make us do it though? Because <laughs> it's too hot in here, Liam. I am not. <laughs> is, it, is, is the radiator off? Uh, yeah, but it's hot in here. It's a bit hot, hot stuff. Hot stuff. What are we going to do on Monday morning? We've got Donna Summer. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to find that now. Yeah. Is that on this bit? It might be, be on either. The oh, no, that's more like it. Feeling hot, hot, hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's too hot in here. Um, I'm not coming in in my swimming costume. Oh. It's not happening. <laughs> <laughs> I'll find that link and it's annoying me now. Yeah, woman. And I'm not tripping off either. Woman at 4,317 <laughs> calories. Like that, though. Of KFC in one second. I know a few blinds in that one. The guy dogs go, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear, yes, we don't need that. <laughs> we're not that sort of station. We're not that sort of station now. Next, we're going to start. We're going to start talking about um, juicing, detoxes, and everything else. And um, that program that was on last night, which I caught the end you of when I got me home. The link, didn't you? Yeah, it's really, really interesting. Apparently, light and life is the one that you should do if you want to save money. But it's not going to do much for your health <coughs> compared to doing some other things. Oh. Oh, there it is. I'm not sure about this. Um, this Superman signal was not what I expected. I thought it was going to be the one that I danced to at um, West Coast Swing. Uh, what you got there? I made. <laughs> I wonder what the hell that was then, Liam. <laughs> Don't come in. It's way to pass it. A pair of jaws. <laughs> Go to the camera and show what you just did. Uh, Get over there. Did I buy one? No. Oh my God. <laughs> I just thought you were holding oh, them. Christmas gifts. <laughs> but no, you want them. Well, they smell. Rose. Rose. Rose Rosy. Scented. So, <laughs> so if you ever stop. We're going back on air, yeah, so on. get out of here. Go on. Go on out of the studio. Da, 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 da. Off you go. <laughs> ah. Don't shut the door because it's too hot. <laughs> Too hot. I forgot my fan. <laughs> oh my word. You have missed it all. It's all been happening here today. And it's all Liam's fault. And it's all Liam. Liam just walked in with a pair of cups, positioned in a very bad place. Well, one was a jug, so it's like a pair of jugs, wasn't it, really? <laughs> with his rose scented candles he made <laughs> on the inside. Nobody wants. <laughs> Take the hint, <head>, Liam. <laughs> Give up making candles. <laughs> could say a lot about that but we're complaining about the heating here uh did you watch the show last night save money good health no which is it's on itv with sean williams and um ron singh he's uh he used to be on this morning he was the tv doctor i know Very good, mean, yeah. yeah well yeah. they were doing last night putting all these diets to the test and all these different things okay and that and um the two that came out on top First, who came in first place, pound for pound for losing pounds, was um, Light of Life. Which is? It's it's a supplement diet. So you're on these shakes and things like that. But what happens <coughs> when you start eating again? Yeah. Well, that's the thing, isn't it? Uh, we've always said that. That's Is that going to help somebody? But you, you know something, at the end of the day, if it's going to make them healthier and better, then good for them. What's it called? Light of Life. She's researching it now. Light and life. I it costs it. about three hundred pounds a month, so it's a lot of money. It costs you about fourteen pounds a day. Yeah. What? I know. But for two hundred, around two hundred pounds a month, you can do the Jason Vale twenty-eight day super juice me diet. How about just eating less? Well, then you save money. Yeah, but then you know, but with Jason Vales, you can actually incorporate it in your diet. Right. Okay. Well, out the two, I prefer Jason Vale. You know that I've done Jason Vale's and it Super Juicer, and so it worked, well. and I kept it off. I only did the seven-day plan, but it got me back onto eating vegetables and things like that. But why does so. it cost so much? Because it's only fruits and veg, isn't it? Uh, well, it all depends on where you shop. See, a lot of people go organic, but... 
They've proved that it's proved it doesn't really work. Well. Yeah, no. as long as you wash them properly and make sure the chemicals mm. are out of there and that. I mean, there's certain supermarkets and actual markets in town. You know, they're, they're doing like pound for a bowl and things. Yeah, like. I was going to say, Coventry yeah. Market do that. Coventry Market do all that. Yeah, and if you if you live in Birmingham, you can go to the Birmingham markets there. Even though I don't tend to go there, I like the indoor markets because I know that air pollution has not got on my food. That's very true. Because I don't like being getting. Because if you go to supermarkets later on in the day, mm. any things that have got that day's date on, yeah, which are going to be all right for a couple of days, mm. they sell off for pence. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. Super juicing, it's hard to get round at first, but once you get into it, it's like wow. I've seen some of I mean, you, no, but you saw me that day here on the green juice, and I was hyper as anything. Yes, I wouldn't recommend yeah. it. Yeah, my classes don't like me when I'm on the super juice, <laughs> when I'm teaching dancing, because they know I've got too much energy. They were really pleased I wasn't on it last night, but next week, girls, <laughs> and guys, we have one man. Oh, bless lucky. him. Yeah, next <laughs> week, I, well, I mean, I went easy on them last night. We'll be talking about fitness again later on in the show. Well, it was your first night back, wasn't it? Yeah, I took it gen. Well, it wasn't my first night back, but it was their first no, night back. No, it was their back. first yeah. night back. I've been dancing on and off all the way through the Christmas period, as you know. And, um, yeah, so these diets and that. I know somebody that did Lighter Life. She did really well. Yeah. Uh, but the one thing she said, her nails were weak and her hair was brittle and it didn't really grow. Whereas I know someone else that did the super juicing better than me, and she did really well. Not only that, her hair really grew, her nails were nice and strong, her, kim, her skin was lovely and bright. So, if so you, you're if obviously you, getting better, better vitamins. That's and right. But I also know a friend that's done Slimming World, who he's amazing actually, he's done really well. And I find that men do better on these diets than women. It's something to do with the our way of. Slimming World and Weight Watchers and all that is. Mm. I don't understand why anyone would want to go and get weighed in public. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't oh, look, you've only lost half a pound. <laughs> you got to eat dust, love. Dust, yeah. dust. Eat some dust. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. But the thing is, if you're going to do these diets, you need to exercise. Otherwise, you're going to end up with too much loose skin. Yes. I've already got that going on. I've got a bit of bingo wings going on. I don't know what, I've seen how you move your arms. I know. Yeah, but only you move the lower part, really. I really should remove the arms a bit higher, what do you reckon? Yeah, get on with it. I should put more weights on my arms, even though I'm not allowed to with my eye problems. Oh, yeah, of course. But uh, otherwise, you need to go and sit in the sauna. Sweat it all out. We're sat in one right now, aren't we? Don't do us any good. We're not half a stone lighter by the time we leave, are we? I know. We should be. We should be half a stone lighter. Yeah. So, this is how we're feeling right now. I hope that you're in a nice temperature of room and that you're not too cold or you're not like us, too hot. <laughs> oh wow, it is too hot now. So who have we got watching? Oh, hello! We've got Addison watching, we've hello, got Daryl watching. Hello, Daryl. Let's see who else. Let's have a look. Let me have a look up there. And up on our Facebook Live as well, we've got John watching. Trisha Doobie. And we've got Ian Michelle's watching. Michelle's got a lovely pair of jugs. <laughs> Michelle's Trisha got great Trisha. jugs. Yeah, <laughs> Michelle's got great jugs. How rude. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, Trish. Coffee needed. <laughs> Black currant tea. <laughs> I'm in this chatterbox. <laughs> so after here, I've got a dash home. Get everything sorted. Get in my forties gear. Get the hair and makeup and everything spot on. Put the dance shoes on. Get the outfit on. Off we go. Who's driving? Janet. Oh, that's all right. Janet that rang in here that one week. You can get a celeb celebrity slim. Seven day starter pack for twenty ninety nine. What do they eat? Paper. Rice paper. <laughs> yeah, look, it just looks like the same with everything else, like yeah. um, juices and stuff. See I try slim fast, it just made me hungry. <laughs> yeah, but that's chemicals. How is that gonna be good for your body? Care but you know, taking chemically induced stuff it's not gonna be good for you. Let me see what it's got in it. If it's, it's got a four chocolate shakes, two strawberry shakes, two vanilla shakes, two. You can talk about shakes. that in a minute. Two cafe latte shakes, one roast chicken soup, one garden veg soup, one program guide, and one shaker. Well, every time I've done a Jason Vale, I've always near enough gone vegetarian. Nearly. But the bacon sandwiches pull me back on a Saturday morning. <laughs> <laughs> but no, um, you know, I do like my chicken. I do like, I do like my chicken. Yeah. Meat. Oh, who flashed me? I saw a flash at the top. 
Oh, we're, get, we're getting uh, messages. To hey, some... I need some al aloe al. She needs some. She's laughing out loud. <laughs> and be criticised. You don't need to be criticised, Kay. You're wonderful. For goodness sake. What about hypnotherapist helps? I'll hypnotise you. Yeah. <laughs> Stay away from the chocolate. <laughs> Give it to me instead. Yeah. yeah. Send all your chocolate to Michelle. She'll eat it for you. I really don't need. Right. Best thing you do. Is take a picture of yourself. And put the chocolate. You want a photo of yourself with chocolate when you're looking awful, don't you? I don't and when you're slimmer, chocolate. you want a photo of yourself with fruit and veg. Or put or put the the photos you don't like of yourself on all the bad foods. I was told that. So what you don't know if you're not cooking though, does it? No. <laughs> That's my biggest thing, yeah. When I'm cooking, I'm <laughs> <good. laughs> Oh God. I'm just putting the dinner out, I'm not hungry. Feeling hot, hot, hot. The back. Ooh. Oh yes, we are hot, hot, hot in this hot. Studio, bedroom, how hot? I think we should bring a thermometer in here, you know. Boiler room. I think it's hotter than my tea. I think actually, <laughs> if we were being paid, we could go on strike. I think it's a rich strip. <laughs> <laughs> we could go on strike because there is a rule say, about this. I was going to say, that's a person of the station. Here, right? Actually, there's no rule about how hot it is, it's only about how cold. Oh, uh, actually, no, there used to be a rule because yeah, I know when I used to work in education. It used to be one because with like, special needs kids, they couldn't handle the heat. No, nor could I. Nor can I. Nobody seems to care. Yeah, we do need a thermometer in here so we can see how hot we're going to get. But it's a shame we can't get a tan while we're at it, even though I go red, so there's <laughs> not really much point with that. <laughs> but um, you just saw something on um, one of the posts. I did. I was just looking at some of the things and there's, there's, a, there's a thing called... Celib celib get your words oh, out. <laughs> celebrity Slim Starter Pack. Yeah, what's in that? Now what's in this is it's a, supposedly a week's worth. Mm -hmm. four, four chocolate shakes, two strawberry shakes, two uh -huh. vanilla shakes, two banana shakes, two cafe latte shakes, one roast chicken soup, one garden veg, one program guide and one shaker. That's meant to last for a week. Forget it. Do you know why? They ain't gonna last a day. That's that's chemical. <laughs> well, that's not gonna last you a day. <laughs> Four chocolate shakes for breakfast, two for me. <laughs> yeah, Michelle likes the milkshakes. I mean, we're only talking once, one, two soups. Uh, mm -hmm. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Twelve shakes. Yeah. For a week. Obviously, there must be some sort of because you get you get a program guide. So I'm guessing there's chicken and veg and stuff in that that you have for one meal a yeah, day. Yeah, but you look at the ingredients inside these packets. It's all chemicals. Ingredient. Hold on, I'm done. Oh, here we go. Yeah. She's finding the ingredients out now. But if it comes in a powder, it's going to be chemicals, isn't it? Yeah, it's got a lot of... Yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah, she's finding all the C and E numbers and everything else. and. Yeah. Yeah, you don't want to put that stuff in your body. At That's least... an awful lot for a shake. <laughs> like... Yeah. 20 and there's all these e numbers sodium mm. this and copper that and yeah well, if you look up jason vale and you look up the juice junkie and joe cross at least with them it's all proper vegetables that come in their natural state that you have to wash and clean and then buy a juicer and a blender because they also do smoothies because you need some roughage and fiber otherwise you're going to be constipated so <laughs> no you don't want that well, it makes you heavier again can it that's well well only for a bit and then it comes <laughs> Yes, don't be too far away from the let's, bathroom. Let's, mm. let's not talk about <laughs> oh, Yeah, you sent me a picture last night, didn't you, or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> BT Radio are going out on a day trip <laughs> to visit some Oh, yeah, I can't remember where it was now. Somewhere they've opened a museum of poo. <laughs> it's the Poo <laughs> Museum. Oh, I hope well. it ain't scratch and sniff. <laughs> Oh, I think I've got to go to a song. <laughs> Scratch and sniff. <laughs> Just come to me. I'll bet it is. <laughs> Man who's been
husband not to buy me chocolate. That's oh, fine. right. Right. Kay's oh. husband, you're not allowed to buy a chocolate. And Kay says homemade soup maker. Homemade soup. Homemade soup, soup, maker, yeah. soup maker. Well, Jason Vale does a plan with them um, soups. See, I like soups. I yeah. love soups. I'm just, I haven't got time to make the other them. Day I couldn't, see how dancing. The other day I couldn't, well, I didn't make it. It came out of can, but I couldn't be bothered. I didn't know what I wanted to eat. Mm. So I just had some tomato soup and some croutons and it was lovely. There you go. I'm having a good day with these headphones. <laughs> you can't make it smaller. Let's make it smaller at the top. Who's had the big head in that one? Is that Ben? <laughs> ben, if you're watching, you got a big head. <laughs> I can't say that on the mic, can we, live? <laughs> mm. Right, let's get some decent music out. It's okay. Mm. What with my son like? It's his birthday on Sunday. Tell you what, I'm going to try and get them all. Look. I don't want that actually. Some dreams. I just want that one. Got some decent music on today. Quite happy about this. Just the one. Oh. So I'm not interfering. That's because you can't. <laughs> I can? Well, yeah, you can, yeah. What? Okay. Alright, leave my. Yeah, we've got to ring Sevy in a minute. Can, what's can. She, wait a minute, who's what's she put up there? I can't read that. Oh Where are you? <laughs> forgot it. We need wireless headphones. <laughs> Case homemade soup maker. Shit happens sat in car eating. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to ring Sevy? Get him ready. Um how long have I got well, no, probably when we start the next one. Alright. Because I've only got a minute. So Sevy's watching. I know Daryl's watching. Daryl's <laughs> Do I, phone? do I have to pass you this or do I just press one? You press one. But I but leave that off. Yeah. Or can I put that I back know. on? Yeah. No, leave it off. Leave it on the side. Tell you what, I'm gonna go straight into this next tune. Okay. That'll pop now you can ring him. Have a go. Yeah, he's not really taught us how to use the phone properly yet, has he? No, like I said, you get full training, is it laughing off? <laughs> Liam! Just asking that question. <laughs> oh, Quick things of the day. Me. Ed Sheeran has released a new single. And he was thinking of um, Rihanna when he made the first one. Castle on the Hill, Shape to View. What shapes the castle? Hello, that is that Sebi? Uh, hello, it's Miss. It's not Cat. <laughs> oh, we're good. she's going straight into the next one. Well, I hope she is. Hold on. Yeah. Dreams can come oh, true. Oh, did you hear us talking about the Pooh Museum? <laughs> Scratch and sniff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's disgusting. Yeah, we haven't had any training on the new phone. Rubbish. <laughs> Hold on a minute. I'll put you on to um, Cat a minute. You get over there. Can I be here? Hello, young man. God, you're very quiet. Is on this that better? Because I've just turned it up. Uh, you are. I'm just moaning about this phone. It's very quiet. There we go. <laughs> yeah, that's better. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, yeah, it's all right so far. Yeah, the first half hour. <laughs> Stop laughing, Michelle. Sorry, say that again. Uh, you can talk about whatever you want today. Near enough. So you can talk about your um, speed dating. Speed, yeah, all right. Speed dating. No swearing on air, you know that. Um, yeah, I know. I know you do. So you can, and Daryl's watching via Periscope. Yeah. Daryl, Sevy says hi. <laughs> so, yeah. What is, she, what is she doing? What are you playing with my You've thing for? You've put a load of in. Sorry. <laughs> She's messing about with the system here. Look. Do you want me to take over? Yeah. Wait a minute. Oh, God. Ah. There you go. It's gone now, Michelle. Are you happy? Yeah. There you go. There you go, Michelle. Add some music. She's, in, she's got a mouse, but she hasn't got anything to control. Oh, me. <laughs> um, so, when we're ready, I'm going to press line one and, he'll, and Sevy will hear the music. Sorry? Say that again. What time?
Oh, uh, Scott, I am. Um, oh, blimey. I did a night. I'll send you the video link. Uh, samba. For a, yeah. For. No, you don't know what Samba mm. is? I did, I did last night on Periscope, so I did some Samba. I basically taught a whole crowd of um, non dancers to do the Samba straight away. They had a Samba band on, Christmas party type of thing. So I do events like that. So yeah. Yeah, I get the party started type of thing. I know, that's right. And Mick Penny lives very close mm. to me as well. You know Mick Penny. I know don't Mick Penny. Oh, well, even Michelle knows Mick Penny. Everybody knows Mick Penny. Being around is an old, old boy. Tudor Rose. No, I know him from football. Yeah, well, he goes in Tudor Rose and he went in there once until I got chatted up by a lesbian and I ran out. <laughs> <laughs> well, it felt like that. She was scary. Well, I know what to do with a man. I don't know what to do with a woman. That sounds really bad, don't it? But, you know. That's obviously just one artist. Yeah. All right, we'll go on to another subject. Um, <laughs> but she did have a good handbag. Finished. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. And we're back live on air. <laughs> what happened there? It seems to cut out. You're too busy talking. Oh dear. And um, hopefully... Do you want me to press line one? We should have line one. We should have Sevi on the line. Sevi, can you hear me? He yeah, I'm good, thank you. Oh, he sounds like he's um in the middle of nowhere. Do I, have to oh. I don't know if I can tweak with these knobs. You can. Can you hear... You sound like you're in a dustbin. I'm mess in a dustbin or something, or in the bathroom. I tried to tweak... Ah, that's the one. Domesticated. That's <laughs> right. There you go. He still sounds too too um quiet. I'm trying to turn you up here. Yeah, yeah. we're fine. We can hear you. We can hear you. I hope the listeners can hear. You. Yeah. <laughs> But Sevi's doing um, some new gigs in um, Coventry because Sevi's mm. not only a radio DJ, and I've been following him longer since I've been being a radio DJ. Myself. That is called stalking. Stalk All right, I've been stalking you, Sevi, <laughs> and um, I've been licking the windows. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen me at your kitchen window looking through? Yeah, I'm on Twitter as well. Yeah, I'm terrible. Oh, she goes on everything. <laughs> oh, she's always up. Well, oh, I'm not. Off. I'm not past three o'clock. Well, unless I'm out on Saturday night. If I told it, I was having one of the girls said to me, "You got to come smooth salsa." It's on till four in the morning. So even if you're out late, you can still come and join us. I'm like, oh god. I used to do that a couple of years ago, but I gave that up for a while. Where's she running away to? We've lost Michelle now. But you're doing some <laughs> big dates, aren't you, in Coventry? Yeah. Okay. Has it got a dance floor? <laughs> yeah. Uh. Uh. yeah. Cool. So about April time, we've got to leave it a bit free, Michelle, because we're going to go and join Sevi. We're a bit of a boogie somewhere, but it's all top secret at the moment. But he's, can't wait. he's also doing something else for the men in Birmingham and the ladies that are single. Oh, tell us more. Yeah. 
That's right. Yes, I do. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Sounds brilliant. Mm. Yeah. Any plans for any eighties night for Michelle's son? Choose life. <laughs> <laughs> Michelle, we went to um a night that had um it was mainly dedicated to George Michael, so they had a lot of eighties. And of course most of the people around there were wearing these t shirts with Choose Life and Michelle's son was loving it. When he was quite steaming, going around going, choose life! Because he's only 19, so he doesn't really understand the 80s music. She's lucky. <laughs> oh. Mhm. Mm <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> old music. I don't like the way they're saying old music. I know. Shh, shh, it's like 30 yeah. odd years ago. <clears throat> yeah, that's not talking about that. In the ocean. That's alright, I was born then. <laughs> it's the 80s. The 80s, yeah. yeah. Crumbs. Makes you feel old, doesn't it? Mm. Old. <laughs> Quite depressing. Sebi, you know, you know your nights. Is there age limits? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because we know a lot of older people, <laughs> single, that need help, and um, <laughs> yeah. If you could take blindfolds as well. <laughs> I'm joking. If you can blindfolds as well. No, I'm joking. Ignore her. <laughs> so, so the first... The f <laughs> like I Dating said, in the dark, isn't it? <laughs> she does stalking, remember? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So the first one's <laughs> for 25 to 35. Yeah. Ah. And then they've got a ready-made DJ for their wedding. You know. You can have out cards for engagement parties. You know, <laughs> weddings, divorces.
That's right. That's true. Yeah, that is nice. Yeah. That's what that's what I do when I'm teaching dancing. I always move the ladies around. Do you know why? Why? Because the men always go off in different directions. <laughs> <laughs> and they get confused. <laughs> Sounds cool. Um. Very good. Yeah, Michelle's looking at me, shaking her head, going, you're not single, you can't go over for the glass. <clears throat> yeah, I know. <laughs> Because we know what happens when I have the one, don't we, Michelle? Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, everybody knows I'm a lightweight. Yeah. There you go. She is a very, very lightweight. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I walked into this bar on Friday night. Michelle shoves a drink in my hand and says, let's have a giggle. Let's watch you. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I was Irish dancing up on stage with the band. Yeah. No, it's, it's funny though. Trust me. <laughs> I'll show you one day. <laughs> Oh, yeah. 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 Got my crisps over there. She don't need a bottle, though. All she needs to do is sniff it. That's enough. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> she is. Yeah. This was a really weak cocktail that she had a quarter of a <clears throat> glass of, and that was enough. <laughs> yeah. We've got, to, we've got to also try Nuneaton because we've never been out in Nuneaton and um, <clears throat> the station is based in Nuneaton and Liam's shaking her head at us going, no, I'd no. Like alright then we'll stick to Coventry and Liam's going, no. <laughs> but we'll sort that out, we'll, te we'll take you out. But I can take Michelle to Sutton Coalfield, seeing you're in that area, I've been around Sutton Coalfield. Well, Michelle could do that, but I'm, unfortunately, I teach dancing on Thursday, so that's not good. But it's one of them. Oh, no, but our class has been going four years now, and the ladies would kill me. <laughs> yes. But we look... <clears throat> Unless I took them all with me. And we're going we're gonna to have to go now, unfortunately. I've got the station manager looking at me. He's about to slap me. And, um, <laughs> yeah. yes, Liam is here. Liam's looking, Liam for, looking love. for love. That's yeah. right. <laughs> Liam is, 
Liam's looking for that. But he's not 25 <laughs> to 35, he's only 18. Yeah, he's 18. <laughs> he's, he's, he's just had hard life. <laughs> you can say that again. <laughs> Could, could yeah, play. you can go go along and have a look. <laughs> <laughs> I've got all the details down. Yeah. If you've got any cleaners there, can you send them his way? <laughs> Same. Yeah, yeah, I've got that down. <clears throat> yeah. 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 Cool. Yeah, fingers crossed. Yeah. Sounds and brilliant. Liam doesn't mind an older woman. <laughs> His face, he's not impressed with me today. <laughs> as long as she's got a pulse, that's the main thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, steam up his glasses. Oh, thank you. Well, we'll post your fi uh, links to our Cat and Michelle show page yeah. and also the BC radio page so that people can find out where you are and how to go out on a singles night. And make sure, guys and ladies, that you are single if you are going. We don't encourage anything else. <laughs> <laughs> on that note, that note. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay, Thanks. take Thank care. Bye. Thanks, bye. <laughs> what was what he was saying? It? He's sorting you out, old woman. Oh, no, yeah. He's okay. Um, the mics are a bit loud, as in they're are scratchy. They? Ah, so okay, if you put them down to naught, that line there. That line there. Yeah, just put them both down yeah. to there. Because if this goes up into red here, okay, then it's too loud. Oh, all right, yeah. Ah. yeah I, should, I should know that, because I DJ. <laughs> if, it, if it's in green, no, green is the highest it to be, really. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so the phone awesome. should get hot. Yeah, yeah, just, we've just had an incoming call downstairs. Okay, no, let's stop the video. Who's trying to ring us then? <laughs>